I guess in the real world you might have to take the head off of, of an animal. Let's see how she does. Let's say that did it. Let's say I'm gonna take the tail off of an animal. There you go. Now we just gut it, put it on open fire. Done. Did it. Warning, this video contains graphic images that may not be suitable for, for little sissy bitches. So, viewer discretion is advised. We kill shit here. What's up everyone? We're gonna do a something a little different. We're going to review a shovel. Okay, we got the Zoom Annihilate, Annihilate Assassin. Look at that thing. It looks pretty badass. Apparently it has a lifetime warranty. Uh, unbreakable, high strength and hardiness. It's gonna be, it's pretty, uh, badass from what I can see we're gonna open it up it's got a, it's 24 in one tool okay so when I open it up it comes with a bag it's a pretty sweet bag really uh, I read the reviews and a lot of people were saying there wasn't going to be a bag, so I was like, okay, no bag, huh? All right, so we screwed it back some. Check it out. Even the box, the box comes lined with foam. I mean, for uh, just a shovel. That's pretty crazy packaging for a shovel. Kind of like that. See what we got here. Looks like we got our instructions. It's got all of our parts and pieces. It's got a fire stick. Let's see what all we got. Convertible short shovel, battle axe, outdoor hand knife. That's kind of cool. <laughs> a shift key, lead drilling hole, camera support. I did not know there's going to be a camera support on this thing. Anti skid ring, survival whistle. That's kind of, I did not know there was going to be a camera support on there. On the very end of it, I can mount my camera on the end of the shovel. Let's see, let's get this opened up. We got multiple pockets for storing stuff. So far, there's nothing in those pockets. Looks like, looks like our shovel. You just pull some stuff out here. I'm not even gonna look at the instructions because most of us would not even look at the instructions. We're just gonna pull shit out, see what we got. And everything is everything's still in plastic because we just pulled it straight out of the box. So. Here's our, here's our uh, strap. Okay, let's see what we got. So this is in fact got a button you can put a camera on there. And I will grab my GoPro and we'll mount it on there. And 
there it is. The badass blade. And it's definitely not as sharp as what I was thinking it was going to be <laughs> when I first saw it. I'm like, shee. I'm just sticking it together without looking at anything. I know which one I want to be the last one. I think, actually. Yeah. We'll go right there. Pinch point, it says. You can pinch your fingers in between the... That's a little bit longer than I thought it was going to be. I'm not going to lie, I, that's getting a lot longer than I thought. Okay. It's a pretty good sized shovel handle. It's out there. Let me see. get my camera in. It's a pretty good size. I don't know what the fucking tape is. Based on my tape measure, we are 35 inches. I'm gonna whistle. Be like off of uh, Titanic. I'll never let go. I'll never let go, Jack. <laughs> Me myself probably won't ever use that whistle unless I'm annoying my wife. But let's hope we don't need a whistle. Got this in there. I'm gonna be cutting some stuff. I need to actually try that out. Mm -hmm. Cut. Sweet. Blade. That's pretty sweet. And then there's this blade. Push a button. Ooh, that could come in handy. Now it's a hoe. I like that. And just like the reviews say, it does in fact not fold down completely. That's as far as it goes. But I will probably just have this right on the Ranger where it's not even folded up anymore. I'm not sure yet. This is going to be for beaver trapping mostly. So we do have to get the instructions out here. Okay. Unscrew this stuff. That's something else. I get it all on there. Hang on, bear with me. I'm cruising along. So on your handle, the knife of your choice. That's not a knife. This is a knife. You can put your knife on there. Somewhere. Once I get this right, <laughs> I should say. Okay, hang on. Okay, let's see if that goes in there. Oh, look at that. Inside of there, your knife is stored now. Now let's put the other knife in here.
But look at that. And you can interchange that with this. You can have any knife on there you want. And there's our fire starter in the end. I don't know if this will work or not. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. Making fire. Woo! I make fire! That was Tom Hanks. Okay, so. As you can see, I usually try to figure out all the stuff that goes together after I open it and all that. I don't, I'm not going to open it up, put it together, and then go, here's my review. But so far, there it is. I can mount my camera there, stick that in the ground, and my camera would be like a monopod. It feels pretty solid. We're going to... Smack some shit and see what happens, but pretty excited. So far, so good. So, all right, let's go put her to some tests. Stay tuned. I'm out here on the trap line looking for a rando tree to chop, and this is a nice little area. There ain't a whole lot of weeds, so we're gonna whack on one of these trees here. What do we want? This big old sucker. It's almost the size of our shovel, so let's take a few cracks at it and just see how it does. Can we cut a tree down with a shovel? Wow! I just took the limbs off. Nothing. Nothing to it. We're making our own beaver chewings. Holding up so far. You could put a lot more of an edge on that sucker if you wanted to. I don't know what part of it's the better cutting part. This side? We are really, we're really going to cut this bitch down with a shovel. <laughs> a freaking shovel, mate. I uh, am not a professional tree cutter. I usually use a chainsaw. Put some good wax on it. Oh, it's got on another tree. We'll go this way then. Oh, it's got on all kinds of trees. Not gonna lie, I uh, that's the first time I ever cut down a tree, decent sized, with a shovel. So, 
I had no intentions on ever cutting down a tree with a shovel. And then we did. So, held up. We have no breaky breaky on well, tree one. Well, some mushrooms would be awesome. Someone wanted me to throw it, but that just seems like crazy talk, but we will see right now. Oh! <laughs> okay. <laughs> well, oh, <laughs> sunk in pretty good. That sunk in real good. Oh man, I did not expect that. I'm not a, uh, I am not a shovel thrower either. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> Oh, that was awesome. That was awesome. I'm just out here. Just checked a, just checked a beaver set. I'm looking at sign. If you look at this tree right here. We're out on the line. We're doing it. We're not going to be cutting trees down. I have no intent on cutting trees down, but one of you out there in the world might. So, figured I might as well cut a tree down and then I just yeeted it into the tree. That was different. Oh, look at that V action. Look at that V action. I mean, that's uh, digging in pretty good. I don't want to end it now. Dig some holes here. Oh, we hit sand. It's pretty, pretty simple to dig a deep hole. You can plant a tree pretty quick right there. That's a pretty big around tree right there that you probably wouldn't even want to conquer with an ax. In my, in my opinion. I would just leave that alone if I was out here. I'd go after something a little better, a little dead. Wax it pretty good. I hear where a beaver's been going out. I'm just gonna cut me a bed here. Make this look like a slide still. I mean, just, I can see they're already going in and out, but I want it to attract somebody, something that ain't been going in and out. Fake slide. There we go. We're going to put our so, so basically, I ain't going to. Gonna use this shovel a lot for for this sort of thing. Cutting my trap beds and so on. Don't really have any plans on cutting down any trees. Usually if I'm camping I'm cutting stuff that's dry so I could burn. So I'll just find stuff that's already on the ground. But there's our slide. Now I'm back in the shed, but there's the GoPro on the 
with the camera attacher right there. You can just stick this in the ground and then record your stuff. It's a pretty cool shovel. Um, thanks for watching this video. Check out all the stuff that this shovel will do on the line. I mean, that's where it's gonna it's gonna be put to the test. So I just wanted to give you guys a quick review on it. But it's gonna be in the Ranger with me everywhere I go. So thanks for watching. Stay tuned.